now. All right, welcome to Give It A Shot Garage. Today we have Max here with us. Welcome to Give It A Shot. Thank you for having me. Um, so what's going on with your car? There is a loud banging up against, like a thumping underneath my car, and I suspect it to be the drive shaft center support. It's a Mercedes 1988 190E. It's also your birthday today, huh? It is, yeah. It'd be a good birthday present to do some yourself. Yeah. I see the part. Where is it? Uh, so I found out that there's a heat shield in the way by the catalytic converter. So we gotta take the heat shield off to get this, you know, part that's on there taken off. And you can really see why some people don't like doing this themselves. That looks like All right, it. Alright, I think this is the part right here. That looks like it. It's just like it. I can't believe we have to take this whole drive shaft out. How do you even get it out? There's three bolts that hold it on back here. And then the whole thing slides out from the transmission up front. No way. I can't believe that, but I, well, let's do it. Can I give it a shot? Absolutely. Oh. Why do you need my help? This is a pain in the ass. All the fucking time. I'm the camera guy. Well, come on, man. All right. You've got to get a wrench on there somehow. Okay, you couldn't do it? I almost got it. I'm not sure if they're the right size. Okay. Rest your head on this. Okay. Serious. Thanks. A pocket for your head. Thanks. Isn't that better? That makes a lot of difference. I can't fucking see anything under here. Well, I don't think I can get a wrench back there. Yeah, I can- Ah! Fuck! The fuck is that thing? That was awesome. It just looked like tools came out of my hair. Hey, Miles, do you want to give this a shot? Whoa. What is all that shit? I don't even know what those things are. Where's the thing that fits it? The Allen wrench. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 16 will do it. I can get a wrench on it now. So it's going to be a pain in the ass, but it's doable. You just have to figure out the right place to put the wrench. And uh, you can twist the drive shaft a little bit since the car is in neutral. And that's that. Nice. Where'd the nut go? What size fits this shit? At least say two in German. There's a Glockenspiel in the way. Are we having strudel for lunch? Stop being a sauerkraut. <laughs> it's important not to lose these guys. I'll take them. How do you know the sizes of wrenches so good, Scott? A bunch of people that can just be like, oh, give me a seven eight. All right, so we got the bolts that hold the drive shaft to the transmission off. Thanks to our handy cameraman Miles. The center support bearing for the drive shaft is right here in this little area. You can see that it's ripped away, it's pretty torn, and replacing it is definitely a great idea. It's not gonna fall on you, is it? Nope. It's gonna fall on me? Nope. What the fuck is this? Oh, holy smokes. Holy shit. That's awesome. Okay, and now it should slide out of there. Oh, nice. <laughs> you know, I'm holding up a drive shaft here. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> we got the drive shaft out, the old one. This is the back end of it. And uh, there's a bearing here that supports it while it's, uh, while it's spinning. And it's mounted in some rubber, and over the years the rubber just shook loose. And uh, the thing was bouncing around in there while driving, while Max was driving, so it seemed uh, probably didn't sound right. And um, we're I gonna, got it, Max. I figured it out. We're going to replace it with a new one. Oh, See yeah. See how that goes. It should fix everything. Future. Yeah. I should say, actually, the past. There's the old bearing. We're just going to get this new piece on here. Scott's taking the old one out right now. Um, this rubber is all that's left of the old one. This one has a bearing with the rubber so the drive shaft can spin freely inside of there and this thing bolts back up underneath the car. We figured out the orientation of it and it's time to get it back on the drive shaft and try to button this thing back up. The piece I have is metal. There's the drive shaft with the new piece on there, ready to spin. It's on the right way? Yep. Are you having fun? That's okay. It's not the best, it's not the worst. You guys ready to get this thing in here? That is perfect right there. If it goes in, that should be it. Uh, just be careful, my hand's under here, it's like wedged. 
This is fucking a pain in the ass. You're doing great. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you too. You really did a good job. This is a wrench. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Look at That's, that. Look at that. It's on there, huh? It's on there. I can't believe we just did that. I'm fucking freaked out. You get the long ones. The long ones go up front. They're, they're pain in the dick, but uh, if you can't get them, I'll get them. Top tip. It's going to be kind of shitty, but you're going to have to do it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. We, we were talking about how it's important to get... Since we took the drive shaft apart, apparently it's balanced, so it can't... Um, it's It can fall out of balance if you put it back... If you put it back together, staggered, and it might make the car shake a little bit. So uh, we had to make sure that we got it back together as close as we could. How's it going? It's fucking bullshit. But I'm just about done. What do you need? Just the socket? I need the socket and the driver. Ah, here you go. All right, heat shield's just about on. So get the fuck out of here. Not be under here anymore. All right, perfect. Come on. We're trying to encourage everyone that you can do it yourself. Even a bunch of dummies like us can take care of it and get something fixed. Max learned a lot today. And we're inspiring you to give it a shot. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs>